what you're seeing right now is a backboard that's being supported on the true bounce lift we have a lift that we use that supports the backboard while doing the work that you need to do to take the backboard down what you're seeing right now is the uh, gentleman taking down the board nine times out of ten you're going to need to cut with a cutoff wheel the bolts that are existing um, typically they come through zinc and they typically rust after you know good 10 years or so and they have a tendency to bind up once you've cut all the bolts off the attachment points from the pole to the backboard you can see here in the video that the lift is doing most of the work supporting it while the man is doing the work in the back once the final bolt has been cut you can release the backboard whether you're using staging whether you're using ladders step ladders uh, or a lift of this type you'll be able to take the backboard down. What you see here is uh, the installer using the lift once again to position the backboard up into place, uh, typically leaving it around 12 inches away from the plate and the backboard surface. What he'll do is he'll adjust the lift, and if you're using staging or you're using ladders, this would want to be positioned in such a way where you would be that distance away once putting the backboard up. Once the backboard's in place at the rim uh, rim height to pole height there will be four bolts which will be supplied that will attach the rim the backboard and the plate welded to the pole as one unit once it's in place you'll be able to clean the surface which will be very clean to begin with you just want to give it a good cleaning and the reflection that you have will be your own in the picture here you can see what it was before and what we have now True Bounce, performance matters.